Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Interchange by Demon Arisen. So, back when I used to play the Demon Arisen maps all the time, uh, I just basically added all of Demon Arisen's maps to my queue, and apparently this map was, uh, after I added it to my queue, it was made private, and then it's recently been made public again, and, uh, it just reappeared in my queue one day, and I'm like, what, what, what is this? So, yeah, let's, let's check this out. This is it. Demon Arisen's 40th test chamber, and it's one of their best yet. From 2014, that is. This challenging brain teaser is almost certainly their hardest one ever. You'll have to use all the wit and intelligence I can muster in order to complete it. Sorry, I'll have to use all the wit and intelligence I can muster. Estimated difficulty advanced. Uh, advanced for 2014. Let's keep that in mind. Right, let's get started. That is our exit condition, as well as us being actually up here in the first place is another exit condition. Don't forget, standing in front of the exit is an exit condition. Otherwise, he wouldn't have open door policy maps. Right. Well, isn't that interesting? How might we get up there, huh? Interesting. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, so we need a funnel for that. Cannot do that by flinging or momentum or any such things. This grating looks very transparent. It kind of looks like the cube is floating on nothing. Right, so does it auto-respawn? I'm assuming it does. Because it auto-dropped. Yes. Gotcha. What does this button up here do? And why is there portal surfaces in front of it? Interesting. So that must be what this outside logic is for. Basically just to make a fancy animation. That would be... my guess. It might also be to, like, prevent people from spamming it real fast or something. I don't know. Huh. Looks like this is how we would get our funnel, right? Yeah, but then this fizzler is the issue. Interesting. So it seems... In order to hit that, we need that laser pointed at a portal surface, but we need this cube to create a portal surface there. Etc, etc. And probably some wacky angles aren't gonna work too well for that. Hmm... So what is over there anyway? I'm guessing portal surfaces. Let's go find out! Yeah, I'm guessing those are portal surfaces right there. Yep. That's exactly what they are. Okay. Hmm. Well... Give me this. Let's go... investigate. Yes. So we can't really aim at much from here. I mean, we can aim at that wall, but that doesn't really seem particularly helpful, to be honest. That's just gonna be a weird angle that we can't really do much with. Yeah, that'd be way too much of an angle. Right. So that's not it. I think... we would maybe want to do something... Like this, and then we respawn the cube once we're done, or such. Something like that. So basically what I'm thinking is... Let's see, how do I line this up? That is... approximately there, right? Yeah, let's go with that for now. Jump over this. And... if we do this... Supposedly... Yeah! That's exactly what I wanted. So then we can put a portal there. And then respawn this cube, like this, and put it on the button up over here, so that we can get into the funnel. I think that's reasonable enough, don't you? Right, and that allows us to go and press this button. Gotcha. And... press. Oh. Presto! Hey, Presto, give me my cube back, thank you. Right, so now we have... this. Interesting. Kinda seems like we wanna do the exact same thing, right? Except put this cube in the line of fire. Yeah. So we put this cube in the line of fire, right? Uh, I don't know how best to center it, but this should work right about there. That should be good enough. And then we basically... 
Ooh. The problem is that we still don't have enough cubes to do what I was gonna do just now. Hmm. Yeah, because if we redo everything, we need- we end up with having that laser cube no longer pointing over here. Which is a problem, and we need the funnel in here. To go up here like this. Oops, excuse me. Can we get me up there, please? Yeah, hmm. Wonder what those are for? I guess just decoration, perhaps? Wait, we don't need the funnel in here. Unless it's unintended, but I don't think we need the funnel in here. So, let's, uh... Let's just see if we can go without it for now. Cause I think we can just momentum our way up to the exit after we set up the laser cube as needed. Walk over here... Do this... Walk over here... Yada yada yada, we cross the gap. And... Then we put our portal... Yeah, basically the same thing as we did before. Yada yada yada... And give me that. I'm too lazy to walk up there. There we go. So then we should just be able to do this, right? Yeah. And then I'm a bit confused about what we might want to use the funnel for. Unless we need to get this cube inside. That might actually be it. So. So let me show the unintended solution first, because that one's easier to demonstrate. If we do that... ...and... ...do this. Yeah, so this is the unintended solution, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure we're not meant to be able to do that. So... I mean, it's easy enough to fix that, I suppose. I guess you would have to remove all the portal surfaces in here or something. Like, sequester that away or something. Or just change which portal surface you fire at from inside. But anyway, so that's the unintended solution. Let's do things the intended way instead. Let's see... Right about there. And then we walk up this. There we go. And then... Walk the portal over there. Walk through here. Run all the way over here. Grab this. Don't kill ourselves on the laser. Walk all the way back. Right. So then we can just do this. Uh-huh. Yeah, and then we can just respawn this cube. That is what we need to do. And that other cube can just stay there all day long. I believe, anyway. So let's see here. Now we have the funnel with us. This seems much more intended, and much more clever. All the way up. All the way up. And there you have it. There you have it, folks. Let me just set this up as per normal. And we can get out of here. Eat map dinner is in just needs some slight tweaking, and it'll be fine. Right. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!